Let's see what it is. They told me. Fang, I'm so, so sorry. Can you forgive me? I just... Oh, it was such a stupid idea. The stupid Avio. Well, howdy all you cool creatures. I'm Cryptid. Welcome to the Cryptid Plays YouTube channel. Today, we once again return to the town of Sandrock in my time at Sandrock. If you recall, last time we saved Pen from his own vanity because of the mirror that we and Chi created for him. We also finished fixing up the mobile suit and Arvio had a plan to kidnap X and I feel like we kind of broke Fang's heart, but that is what happened. So the only content warning that I have for you in regards to this game is the photosensitive epilepsy warning, but if flashing lights do occur, I will put a warning on the screen beforehand. And uh, with that out of the way, let's get started. Oh, X, hello. I'm gonna ask, uh, Fang's not angry? Not angry, Fang. Really? Well, thank you for letting me know, X. Go, give Fang. Gift, gift. Fang wants, make medicine. Maybe now would be a good time to apologize to Fang. All right, now we receive the gift for him. Let's go make Fang happy, I hope, or at least less upset <sighs> I'm sorry already forgotten oh a wonderful thank you Fang I am so sorry we did that I feel so bad before stupid quite stupid RVO usually but oh, not I'm you. I'm stupid. Yeah, I'm stupid. I'm sorry. I wanted to see what would happen. I am so sorry, Fang. Why do this? Oh, 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 yeah. Uh, actually, I wanted to get closer to you. Closer? Yes. I. Accept your apology. Uh, you know, that's better than nothing. You can visit sometimes. Oh, thank you. I, I You won't regret this, Fang. I promise. But don't lie. Yeah. Yeah, I won't. I promise. I hate lying. I literally just want to see what happens. Again. Never again. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can now give him gifts. Heck yeah. Hmm. It worked. It worked. What do you know? Oh, I am feeling powerful. <laughs> <laughs> In days past, on my birthday, we had only six more days to wait before feeling warmth once more. Here, I hardly noticed the difference between winter and spring. Okay, so his birthday is late winter. 24th? Actually, hold on. I have something that he's mostly neutral over, but... My shop also sells this. You can also buy some for yourself. Sure. Here? Oh, coo, coo, coo. It was X all along. It was him. That bird is crazy. What, what have you done, X? I love you. Hmm, do you want... Actually, you know what? Let's give you a worm. Thanks. Say thank you. Thank you. You're a good bird. 
Oh my god. Bang, I can finally become friends with him. Maybe more. He is admittedly pretty cute. Alright. Time to work on other... Wait a minute. Hold on. I have something to do over here. Huh. All right. What you got, Mort? Howdy. Greetings, young one. Settling in all right? Say, if it's not too much trouble, might I make a request? Yeah. My wife and I were here from the earliest beginnings of Sandrock, back when it was little more than an undiscovered oasis. Through it all, I had a relic camera to chronicle our life. Camera? Are we going to get a camera? Also, I just noticed who's here. Um, fascinating. I stored all of the photos inside a photo album, but before the last sandstorm, my memory failed me and I left the album outside. After the storm, it was gone. Yeah. Now I've made peace with losing the photos, but there may be yet time to make a few more memories. Would you make a new photo album for this old soul? Of course. Yeah. Oh. Oh, this photo. This one takes me back. We couldn't be much older than 20 in this photo. This is not long after we met at the Oasis. You two were adorable. She was running her hotel and I was a gardener with no real purpose. We met when I was just passing through. I was instantly struck by her passion. She told me about her dream to share Sandrock's beauty with the world. Yeah. How strange that those fiery eyes full of passion would soon instead be full of tears. And all because her dream came true. Indeed, she shared her oasis with the world, but the world did not return the same kindness. Alright, I'm gonna do my regular voice. Nothing gold can stay. Time, regrettably, marches on in only one direction. Perhaps Sandrock was destined to be used up. I tried my best to turn back time in the desert. I was but one man, and my quest was folly. Hmm. She looked so happy in this photo, I had almost forgotten about that look of hers. If only I would stopped her that day, when she went to check on the straw grid. Oh, sorry. I've kept you too long, haven't I? I actually want to hear more. Like, seriously, it's interesting. If not a bit sad. Young one, thank you for bringing this to me. It feels good to share these old stories with someone who will hear them. Please stop by if you find any more of my photos. Yeah, you got it. I didn't even realize that's what happened. Hi, Grace. Hello. You know, I really like walking around this desert setting. I don't know why. Maybe I was born under the Phoenix Star. I could see that. See ya. Bye. Right. Before I do anything else, I really want to work up to get to an intermediate assembly station. I know I said intermediate weird, but <laughs> but yeah, I really want that. Okay, all I need is three more microchips to do that. I have enough money, as far as I'm aware. Oh, hey, it's Unsure. Hello. I'm lucky to have Justice as my commanding officer. He always takes care of me and has my back. Don't know too much about your boss, Yan, though. Yan doesn't have my back, I assure you. Be seeing you. Alright. I'm actually gonna go head to Gecko Station. See if I can actually get some, uh... Microchips. Wow, I totally forgot that word.
Well, I didn't find any microchips, which kind of sucks, but I guess I can just keep buying them from Rocky for now. Well, hi, Miguel. Hmm. Take care. Vaguely unsettling to come back to Miguel being in front of me. Not even gonna lie. Well, I guess I'm done for the day, so I'll put the builder to bed. Alright, let's see. I should make a photo album. Uh, I'm going to need leather. Which, unfortunately, I have to get from the wild yakmel. Alright. I'm gonna go, unfortunately, fight some monsters in a second here. Let's go! I should also get more copper at some point. I've been slacking on getting that. That's okay. I need sea salt. I always forget about that. Also, while I'm at it, I might as well see what commissions are available. <laughs> you know something I ought to do? I ought to go actually check out the desert now that I'm able to go out to Gecko Station and stuff. I think I might do that today. There's also something to do at the clinic. I am a little bit surprised, but let's see what it is. They told me. Fang, I'm so, so sorry. Can you forgive me? I just... Oh, it was such a stupid idea. The stupid Avio. Forgive you. Oh, thing, you are just so kind. A lot of people probably would take longer. Builder explained. Thang, thank you so much for forgiving me. I truly am, with all my heart, sorry. Apology accepted. I promise you. I will never make such poor judgments again. I hope not. I'm glad that uh, they get along now, hopefully. Hey, have you talked to Fang yet? He's still kind of mad, but he doesn't hate us, which means our plan worked. All it took was for it to backfire completely. See? I knew it was a good plan. It was literally such an awful plan, RVO, but I accept this. I'm fine with you, uh, thinking that. Because Fang doesn't hate us. He's cool with us. All right, Mort. Yeah. Ah, this photo album is very well made, isn't it? To be so young and talented, it's as they say, the strength of young waves shall push the old ashore. I shall hold on to this one with great care and look forward to what it might soon hold. Thank you, young builder. You know, my pleasure, Mort. You're, you're awesome. I like helping in whatever way I can. I guess I just, uh, I'm gonna buy a couple things. And then I am going to go out to the desert. I actually am fairly stocked up on foods, but, uh, you know, that's okay. All right, cool. I bought a bunch of supplies, so hopefully, um, until I get my butt over to the Ufala salvage again, I am set. All right, I guess I will head out to the desert. I really want to see what it holds for me. It's, uh, it's 
been a mystery to me so far. But you know, nothing solves a mystery by... Well, nothing solves a mystery better by... Than by going to check it out. Oh, come on, I want to break that. Yeah. All right. All right, what is this over here? In fact, what is anything out here? Bitter bean. Excuse me, that is the best plant name ever. <sighs> Mount Rock Sand, huh? Raw opal? The, uh, the sheer amount of treasures you can get out here is freaking awesome. I wonder if I can... The Dead Sea. I wonder if I can go in here yet. This is so cool though. Well, this doesn't look like it has an entrance. I could look around a little little more. God, oh, this map is gigantic. Okay, so I can't. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so I don't know if I can do anything with this cruise ship yet. Dang, this really was a sea. That's actually really sad. And maybe I can go over to those bones. Alright, let's go check out the things. More things. All the things. Kangaroo people. Is this tank girl? <laughs> I, I kid, I kid. Oh, I'm out of ammo. What is your level, sir? 26. Hmm. What is my level? 23. Um, I don't know if I'm quite high enough of a level to take it on yet. Alright, what, what can I get from the animal bones? I get animal bones from animal bones. You know what? That makes sense. Now what is that place up there. I want to go to it. Oh, please tell me I can make it. <gasps> Pensky! Oh my god, they're penguin huskies. Holy crap, that's wonderful. I've never seen anything like that. That's so beautiful. Holy crap. This is... Okay, yeah, this is just the Gecko Station ruins again. I was like, wait a minute. That looks familiar. Gee, I wonder why. Well, I guess I should head back soon. Alright, let's, uh... Let's put our builder to bed. Probably. Unless I'm able to finish my ore refiner. Which I might be able to. Yeah. Cool. All right, let's place this bad boy. Um I need I need a bigger property soon. Nice. Really cool. All right. 
All right, I'll put us to bed. Hmm. Looks like there's nothing at the moment. Hmm. You know, that's weird. There's something right here. <gasps> Isn't this Mort in this photo? I should bring this to him. Excellent. You know, I believe today is also a fang day. Heck yeah. Hmm? New test subject. <clears throat> Let's head on over to Mort. He's going to be so happy to see this photo, I think. Howdy! Hello again, young one. Hmm? That there. It's an old photo of mine you found, isn't it? To think, my old photos might all be out there somewhere. May I have it? Oh! Aha! This photo was taken around the time when Zeke first arrived in Sandrock. So cute! He was a small young lad at the time. Who knew he would grow to such heights? Yeah. We found him lost in the desert, separated from his clan during one of our trips to build a straw grid in the northern reaches of the Ufala. We had intended to help him find his kin, but the desert had other plans. So Martel and I raised him as our own, taught him the ways of this land. My wife was very proud of him. I think to her, he was even more precious than the Oasis. This is a cherished memory. Thank you for finding it, young builder. <gasps> I don't suppose since there are probably more photos of mine out there. If you ever chance upon more, could you bring them to me? Then I'd be a happy fly, if I live or if I die. Oh, of course. I love Mort, he's so nice. Let's see, what else should I do? Already working on some things, but... Well, I guess I'll figure it out. I suppose I ought to go try to buy some more microchips. I just realized that the train's still here. Wonder which train this is. Wonder if we can tell by looking. Um, either way, probably don't want to be in front of it. I need one more darn microchip, but... Well... Oh well. I've been having... Wait a minute. That's an X feather. Why is there a feather here? Hmm. I always get a little worried if I see feathers. What? Is this from the last quest? Is that what it was? I could see that. I could see them still being here. Hmm. What is this? Hold on, I found a cave. Why does it vaguely look like someone's been in here? What is this? I've never found places like this. Hmm, well, I got some money. Hmm. This is very interesting. Well, I shouldn't have done that. Shoot. 
loot. All right, there's not much in this cave, it seems. I have unfortunately not gotten out unscathed, but I have gotten out. Why are there two chairs here? Who's spending time in this cave? Huh. Wow, interesting. Whoa. <sighs> that startled me. Well. You know, I might be able to build that bridge up at some point. The one that I found down in the desert? Wonder where that leads. Ooh. I've got a plan. One of the few plans I've had throughout this uh, playthrough. Alright, alright, alright. You know, in the end, I was thinking I may end up going for Fang. I didn't intentionally think of doing that, but he's just so sweet. I know a lot of people in the Sandrock community like him. I'm not sure yet if I'm going to, but um, I'm friends with him, so that's cool. Anyhow, I might as well get my builder to bed. All right, to bed. No, it's another peaceful day. No mail, no visitors. I mean, I'm, I'm okay with that, I guess. Hmm, I just realized I need to make a simple processor. Do I have the thing for that? I don't. Well, that's okay, too. Well, the bright side is, I think I'm going to have enough stuff to make a uh, intermediate assembly station. So that's cool. A pen. Uh-huh. Bye. Oh, I'm actually friends enough with Arvio to, uh... I, I have a commission for you, I'm so sorry! Hey! Thanks. Also, why are you going to bed so early? Do you just... just have a terrible sleeping schedule? What the heck? Or do you nap? That would make more sense, though. It's still kind of early for a nap, isn't it? Ah, the apartments. Construction Junction. I still want to say Construction Junction, what's your function? I know that's not the proper lyrics, but yeah. It's Conjunction Junction, but uh, okay. Hell yeah! Heck yeah! We're on our way to... You know, making better stuff. Did I pick up more photos? I don't think I did. Like, Mort's place is highlighted, but it's like, I don't think I actually have any more for him right now. Oh well. Alright.
Remember, I'm not interested in simply fra- Goodbye. I should have come out the other end. Oh well, that's fine. New test subject! <clears throat> well, it's a shame. I don't think there's much I'm gonna be able to do today. Oh, that's okay. At least the whole thing thing was resolved. That's like the thing I'm most happy about. I was just so saddened by that. Like, it certainly could have been worse, but, you know. <clears throat> okay, I need a better tool to take this place down. <laughs> That's really cool. Need wooden boards. Let's see. Well, that won't take too long to make, I don't think. I need to really get myself a horse or something at some point because I go way too slow. I am pleased to find out that it takes steel bars and not a steel frame. Also, I just realized I can totally start that kiosk. Like, straight up. I was like, totally blanking on that, but I made the uh, intermediate assembly, so. Well, intermediate assembly station, excuse me. You need the station after it. Because otherwise it's like, well, what is it? Assemble what? I wish the wooden boards wouldn't take nearly so long, but that's okay. You know, I'm finally on my way to building that, uh, that bridge. Something that I wanted to do for a while now. I kind of forgot about it, but it's like, well, actually, that would be amazing. You know, I cannot wait to meet Logan and Haru. Like, I am so excited to actually do that. I don't entirely know when I get a chance to meet Logan. I feel like I'm not the furthest from doing that, but um, I couldn't say for sure. It's a shame it's already getting late. I was hoping to get more done. Oh well. You know, not everything needs to be, like, super fast-paced. How many wooden boards does that bridge need? I wasn't 100% paying attention. I was like, oh, boards. I wonder what that bridge leads to. Doesn't look like there's much over here. I need six. Well, that's not bad, actually. That makes no sense, but that's not bad. It probably should be more like 20. Let's be honest. But at the same time, I understand, like, making it easier to actually finish that. I just wish I had completed it during the day rather than the next day. But, you know, that's okay. It happens. Also, I love how the thorny jumpers come out at night. Like, if they're a lizard, you wouldn't expect it, but at the same time, the desert's probably fairly... Oh, 
no, it's cold enough to snow, which deserts do get to be cold enough to snow. I don't know, maybe it's not warm, but maybe they don't need the warmth. Well, all right, we're on our way to building this. It is almost done. I just need the bronze plates. And then that's like about it. So I suppose with that, I should just put my character to bed. All right, I am going to leave it here today. We did not accomplish a huge amount, but we still had fun. At least I hope you all had fun because I did. And you know, Fang forgave us. We can literally actually hang out with him now, kinda. Um, but we're on our way to being friends with him, so that's pretty cool. And we are on our way to finishing that sand kiosk and that bridge out in the desert. Plus, next time I'll probably go and explore more. So, if you like this video, please hit that like button. And if you want to see more of me, but you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe. I upload videos every Monday and Wednesday, hopefully soon to be more. And sometimes I also upload shorts and extras throughout the week, randomly. I also stream on Twitch on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Fridays are usually twice a month, but they have been known to be more. I hope to see you all next time. Bye.